Yep, 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 yep. Uh huh, uh huh. Hi guys, it's Misty and welcome back to my channel. Today I am in Bloomington, Indiana at the Bloomington Antique Mall. Let's go shopping. Honestly, I don't know quite what I'm looking for today. I am just really looking to see what we can find. Now, a antique mall, Westbury Antique Mall has closed and a lot of the booths had come over to the Bloomington Antique Mall. So I have heard that it is quite full. Let's go see. Oh, we got a little... Sailor girl. She's got glands. She is $25 firm. She is so cute. Alright, here we've got a little blue moon and star cream and sugar. And the set is $15. So I think I'm going to get this set today. The July celebration event. I didn't realize. Well, it's kind of fun. Oh, I'm gonna drawing. We're gonna enter the drawing. Well, I have a customer that really collects these shoes, and I like this little baby. I like this little baby glass shoe. It's six dollars with a little daisy and button design. I think it's a match holder. I think it's, I think this might be a striker on the bottom for matches. It's six dollars. I think I'm gonna get that. Here we've got a cobalt blue might be thin sometimes they're not this one does have the cap but i'm going to get this one there's also an amber one but i think i have an amber one so i think i'm just going to get the cobalt one this is a great clock this general electric kitchen clock that great color let's see how much they want for it has run for six months they want thirty dollars for it that's a great clock. I don't think I can do 30, but oh wait, this booth is 15% off unless it's marked firm. So this is going to be 15% off. I don't remember. 29. Oh, I don't know. It's 48. Well, at least we know it's 15% off if we see anything else. Look at this little fella. This little cow will hold your salt and pepper nine dollars firm it's made in japan mm, it's cute but I don't, i'm not gonna get them i'm not gonna get them not today Ooh, this is pretty 48 dollars for this fenton that's beautiful the coin with the uh thumbprint and let's see oh here's a little thing of buttons eight dollars firm for the thing of buttons i think i will do that there's some cool ones in there what about this one Oops, that's this, up here. this is twelve dollars firm there's some navel buttons in there but i kind of like those with the colorful buttons so i think i'm gonna get that one. Oh, it's good i'll just barely walk in the door and i've already got some things in my little cart here See, boy, that's a dining room get up, isn't it? That's a beautiful big table. All right. Let's see. Park my cart and walk over here. I wonder if this, there's a, an event going on, if there's going to be some more sales. All right. This is beautiful. This cut to clear. 159 for the Bohemian cut to clear. That's beautiful. This booth was at the other antique mall because I remember that lady there. This is neat. This is Murano Swirl for $99. Let's see. Oh, look at him painting his fence. Royal Dalton. He's painting his fence, boy. Look at this little owl here. This little stained glass owl. Isn't he pretty? He is, this is glass, he's $11.50. I think that he's fun, so I think I'm gonna get him. Let's look at this fun kitschy cookie jar. Oh, cookies. Just she, she's $95. Oh, she's so fun. Oh, this is like a poofy homemade thing for $9.95. This is pretty too, $24. The 
this pottery base. Oh, let me zoom out a little bit. My goodness. Oh, I don't have Mark here with me today, so, you know, I could look through some of this ephemera, couldn't I? Sweethearts forever. But, like, when I buy ephemera, I like to buy it all together, <laughs> not separate, so I probably won't tempt myself with that. It's over here. Ooh. Well, here's a little pixie guy for $7.50. Vintage pi pixie figurine. He's like a, supposed to be like a little Yadro guy. Cute, but not going to get you today, buddy. I'm a sucker for these little mini swung vases. This one's $10, so I'm going to get that. Look at that cat in that owl frame. He's like, yeah, I don't want to be in this owl frame. It's $4.50. Meh. I'm probably going to regret not getting this. It is more of a contemporary piece, but I don't know. This might be something else. I think I might get it. Look at these lizards on the top of it. The little rainbow lizards saying, hey, that mark on the bottom is intriguing me. Here is a little piece of Van Bruegel. It's brown. I know. I like the shape of it. It is $40. There's a mark on the bottom. Van Briggle. This booth is running a 20% off sale. I still don't think I'm going to get it today, but I will show you something that I did put in my cart, and that is this little turquoise aqua. I believe it's Viking vase for 23 so that's great. So I did get that. Oh, what a fun booth this is. I did see this. I know it's got clowns on it, but it's a little baby apron. Isn't that adorable? It's got clowns on it, but it's still very cute. We got some salt and pepper shakers. Here's some little birds. I don't know if this booth is having a sale. I don't think so. So these little birds. Oh my gosh, they've got the original sticker for 49 cents. They are $12. Where do you pour? What do you shake your salt out of? Okay, let's find what is that it? Is that the hole in the side of its face? Yeah. That's bizarre. You you get the you you pour the salt out of the side of their face. Like that. I love that it's got that price tag on it though. Um, let's see. Oh well, these are fun. A lot of times I found these and I've just found the top. Because there was a cookie jar set. I I'm thinking of the cookie jar. I just found the lid of the cookie jar. These little humpty dumpty goobers. They're forty five dollars. Stay cart stay oh my gosh look at these little fellas and gal he is $15 look at those little cheeks I want to say that Michael has sold those before I'm gonna say our Santa we got some Shawnee little goobers for 15 oh my gosh look at the little monkey um, the monkey and the the crank guy. You know what I'm talking about? He cranks his monkey organ. That doesn't sound right, but you know what I mean. All right, and we've got some ephemera. The happy hour bar guide. Oh, and there's Elsie. Oh, we've got some holiday things. Look at that. It's $20. That's cool. I've never seen that. You hang it on your wall. You've got the bird cage in there. There's a the little bird and your salt and pepper. This little poinsettia lucite. Oh, it's only loose. Oh, it's missing the. It's missing one of the Lucite flowers. That's amazing. The little hoot owls for Halloween. Here's Sparky, or Sparkly, the seven up little fella. Boop, 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 boop. He's 49. Got some blocks for 15. She's got such cool things in her booth. There's these little guys, little ornaments, felt ornaments. Oh, look at that. The little anthropomorphic fruit apron for 10. And we've got a crocheted stocking for 10. I'm having some Christmas in July sales. $12.50. I thought that was a gun. Santa should not have a gun, probably. That's a horn. Oh, let Papa sleep. I do not have any business buying any more bo books. I have so many. I can't help but treasures under the sea. Read me some poems, ma. 
gosh, look at this. They're holding hands. They're best friends. The mushroom and the celery. He's looking a little sketchy, though. I mean, they, neither one of them are looking the, like they're the most uh, courtesy, courtesy, no, the, the friendliest guys in town. It's $10 for that. Oh, here's some more of these pots. I love these. Well, it's 24. These are actually little cottage cheese bowls. I've had some flower pots. Um, $25 for the set of four of those. All right, one thing that I am getting today is this little Kittles cabin. It's $39 firm. It's in great shape. Here, I'll put it on the floor here so I can show you. Look at the inside. How great for a display is this? I also did grab a couple little Kittle dolls as well. Lots of fun littles. Look at this, it's $30 for this little crystal sugar bowl. That's fun. Look at this little, these little, these little guys, the little duck band. I did get a couple things out of the cart and I didn't, or out of one of the cases and I, didn't have my camera ready to film it, so you're just gonna have to be surprised. Um, but there is a case down here on the end that has some amazing Fenton, so I will show you that. But look at this Fenton owl, I think it's $150 or some really pretty Burmese in there. Look at this hurricane lamp, that beautiful the goldfish, just 95 beautiful pieces of Fenton and Weller and Roseville. There's a fairy lamp right there. Oh, I like that little poison bottle. It's 65. Do you see it? Right there. I'm thinking about this foxglove Roseville. It's $49. I'm really thinking I'm thinking about it. I still have to go upstairs and downstairs before I decide our way upstairs. I haven't gone downstairs yet, but we are gonna go up. So this is a fun booth. Oh my gosh, look at this little chalkware puppy for 29. It's a little white frog. He's angry. It's Fitz and Floyd. Just a single fella. And oh, look at that paw holder. It's a serious paw. Oh my goodness, look at these. <laughs> the little giraffes. They're so derpy. They're $10. I may get those. I might. This is great too because they've got like, here's the green and yellows. Then we have the pinks and the blues. So that's like really, a, a it's pleasing to the eye to do that, I think. I think it's Oh my gosh, here's some Lustre Wear st straws. I've got a straw collection. These are $10. I'm not seeing a sale. I, I'm going to say I'm not going to get those because I like the ones in the box. That's how I'm going to justify that. I like the ones that are in the box. It's a cute little cookie biscuit jar. Nice Florida plate. Look at you, little sailor boy. You're American Bisque. He's $10. He's very cute. Look at this little wired flower vase. With that little glass insert. Like a little beaker. Why do I like that so much? I really like that. It's amazing. This bark cloth towel purse. It's $29. That's a cool thing to see. Oh my gosh, look at the fish plates. You could serve, you can use this handle to serve people their food. It's $10 for the two fish plates. I like the dish strainer too, that aqua. How much is that? It'd be great for vintage campers, $20. But aren't those kind of fun? I don't know. I kind of like them. Oh my gosh, I don't do very well with, with um, Afghans. Michael does, but this one's fun. With a square stitch, it is $25. It's really soft, too. I like that it's bright and colorful. I like it. Oh my gosh, you remember these? I've sold these. There's, is there only three? There's four. I don't think I had this one. And I, I didn't know how the story ended. I don't think this is the one I had. 
in the romance of Fifi and Pepe. Yeah, this is this is scene four. I think it's basically they live together forever, but I had the three, but not the fourth one. Fifi and Pepe lived happily ever after, according to this tray. Goodness, look at this pink crochet pillow. It's very soft. It's very got the polyfill on the inside. It's $15, which doesn't seem like a bad price. And then I also see these deer. If you get, they're two, the pair of them are 20 They are made in Mexico. And there's that one. And then his little brother there. This is an amazing box here. It's sort of like a camp or like a crafty trench art. It's $35. This is an antique piece. Oh, wow. That's amazing. It's got like cork and they've painted it. I don't know if it's, oh no. Oh no, I was gonna say it doesn't, oh wow. It's silk lined. It's got the mirror on the inside. A little bit of padding. I think that's amazing. Oh no, it's $85, wait a minute. Oh, 85. I thought it said, I was gonna say $35. I was probably gonna buy it. That's pretty amazing. All right, let's see. What else is over here? It's like some jewelry. What's this? It's a fun little, like a little pla vintage plastic bracelet for $3. Let me try it on my wrist. It doesn't fit. And I have a small wrist. It does not fit. It's made for a child. No, I don't know if it's made for a child, but it doesn't fit. And like I said, I have a small wrist. Uh, oh, we got some little brooches up here. Are there any fun ones? Look at that. Oh, those are earrings. Those are kind of fun, though. From the 80s, little red earrings. I don't wear a lot of red. I'm always looking for... Oh, gosh, there's a whole thing of... You can't even see. Good grief. Oh, this booth is 15% off, by the way. So, let's see. Oh, I like this. I don't know what it's called. I always I never remember, but I like that glass. It's very pretty. In desperate need of a basket up here, but I did find this little Westmoreland frosted blue bud base for $8. I think I'm gonna get that. I did grab some of those pieces of jewelry. Got this little Lucite, it's $3, apple, tomato. These are Leah Sophia. I got these. I got all these earrings for me. Those for me. Those for me. And I love these metal earrings. So those three for me. Three dollars each is a great price. But I was looking through this booth here. Um, these intrigued me. They're made in Occupy Japan. They're five dollars, but they do have some petals that are broken off. This is Czechoslovakia here for fifteen. And then over here, there's a good piece of kitsch. Oh, oh, look at these little bitties, though, too. Oh, are you a sperm? You're a tadpole. Good grief, Misty. Get your mind out of the gutter. Tadpole. I think I need him, though. He's just different. Look at this fun guy. Oh, oh he's a dancer. Look at him go. All right, let's check him over real good. I didn't realize he... Oh, you're made by New Orleans. I think you're pretty good. I don't see any repairs on you anywhere. Oh, well, you're fine. I'll get you and the <laughs> tadpole. And then this is a little, it's a $3. Oh, he's got some broken ears. This is Pendlefin. I'm not going to get him though. No. All right. This is Bone China, Staffordshire in England. It's got some chippies on it too. All right, so we're gonna get our tadpole and our little dancing dog. So I went down and got me a basket. Ooh, I see some stuff in this booth. Let's see. Hi, kitty. You're 24. Some longer burger. Doggy pig. That's pretty. I think it's a bird. No, a bird, not turkey. You're fun, Jack and Jill. Oh, look over here. We've got some wooden salt and pepper shakers. Salty and peppy, set of two for 25. These are the cat ones. Sometimes they make sounds, they squeak. Those no longer squeak. Salty and peppy, the non-cat ones are 20. And look at this. Look at this get up here. 
You've got the handle here, and then you got your seasoning down there for when you're grilling, so you don't burn your hands. And then look, this guy right here, he's your little spoon. This whole set's 35. I'm your spoon. Pretty cool. Gosh, stranger taste. Look how fun this booth is. Got all kinds. Oh, there's a rainbow bright. Rainbow bright. She's $18. Let's see. Are you the repop or are you the actual one? I think you're a repop. You're a Hallmark. I think that you are not the OG from the 80s, but you're still fun to see. Teddy Ruxpin. What are you? Poopy? Plushy. She is the morsel family baby. Never heard. Oh, it's like little Nestle. She looks like a little poopy. Where are you? Are you the dad? What are I've never, I've never heard of these. I can't even see it. The Nestle Nestle. Oh my gosh, Nestle Peanutty. It's like a little. I don't know. I don't know how much you are. You're seven dollars. You're kind of fun. Your little chocolate chip baby. Oh my goodness, look at this. It's a yep, yep. Yep, 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 yep. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh my gosh. It's a yip yip bag holder for $20. Oh my gosh. It's a yip yip. Yip, 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 yip. That's what we call the swung vases. Oh my gosh. You don't need that, Misty, but it would look actually look cute with a little. Oh my gosh, Misty, you don't need that, but that's, that's a remarkable. I love that. Now I'm back on track again. I'm looking at these, this booth with like the vintage style, some vintage toys. Like that one's reproduction. Oh my gosh. We're not going to bounce the bouncy balls. I don't know if anybody remembers Jeffrey's uh, fun time with the bouncy balls. We're not going to recreate that today. Mountain Dew. I like that shirt. Well... We still have to go downstairs to the basement, which is quite big, but um, I, I did find a few more things. I, I got this that I am going to use for my whatnot sales for books when I have a book sale. I got this. Someone made that. I'm going to get that. They made it out of book pages. It's a hair clip. I thought that might be cute. And then these placemats two placemats so crocheted all right let's let's head downstairs okay now i'm in the elevator and i'm going down to the basement this used to be i think it used to be a few furniture store back in the day so it's got an elevator in it so we're going to go down to the basement oh this way all right Ooh, some sweat Ooh, tiger it's 59 dollars so let's see what we can find down here so we've got this, this little vintage comb for $5. When it rains, look for the rainbows. That's cute. Oh, here's a little lion earring holder. He's $8. There's no we in pizza. I agree. But I did see some Christmas things kind of back here in the corner. And probably right now, a lot of people aren't looking for Christmas stuff as far as being in the antique mall. But I'm having a Christmas sale soon. So I'm going to see there's Ziggy. I'm going to see there's anything that we could use in the sale. Here's a nativity set for 10 Oh, well, Mary, why are you... Oh, there's another Mary in there. Well, oh, there's a brain. In that basket. Basket full of Garfields. I don't think these are from the... Some of them maybe are from the... Mm, I don't know, five dollars each. I don't think a lot of them are from the 80s. So these are original 1980s jelly shoes. Who else remembers these? I'm going to try them on to see if I can bring back some memory time. My goodness, memories. Man, I used to run around the neighborhood in these things, ride my bike play outside. I wish I'd bring it. Well, I mean, these fit me. How much do they want for these? $24. I'm not going to get them, but memories. There's so many people here. The music's very loud, but I am going to get these. They're $18 for a set of four. These Starburst Jello molds. There's different colors. I don't know. I just, I like them. I'm going to get them. 
Here's a little, she's 15. She's a French lady. I'm a French lady. Look at those eyelashes. She's got a, I, I'm assuming that's a dog in her lap. She is marked Paradou Paris, made in France. I'm gonna do a little bit of research on her and see if I wanna get her. This is Neko brand. Oh, baked beans. Neko Boston baked beans, croc. This guy's cool too. He is $12 for this mug. Mm, this is neat. This is probably, yeah, left in this rooster cookie jar. It's 40. Some, ooh, look at these little, little uh, nut, nut bowls. Treasure Craft 1962. Wonder how much the whole set is. Let's see. $60 for the whole set. It's a snack tray. For that. Yellowstone. Francoma. Warmer, so you'd put a bowl on top of there. Oh, here's a little piece of uh, paint by number for $6. It's a nice little size, really. Covered bridge, paint by number for $6. I'm not going to get it. No. Oh, I like him. He's so cute. He's going to get those little tarts. All right, let's see. What else is over here? I'm trying to talk a lot so we don't pick up the music, but I don't know if we're going to be that lucky. But I will do a little bit more research on her. Here we have some little um, cold cream jars there. Unfortunately, there's only one of those mugs. Okay, keep looking. Gosh, it's another clown photo. Nope. Well, I got some great things in there. I even got myself a purse. I did in the antique mall. So it was a great, it was a great shopping experience. Uh, the one thing that I have to say, and I was telling them when I was checking out that how much I appreciate how prepared they are. I have been in antique malls and I've been to a lot of them. And you go and it will take 45 minutes sometimes to check out because they won't wrap anything up. And I understand that they want to make sure that you're getting everything and you're not going to put anything back. And I usually say, I for sure am getting this, or I am for sure getting this in hopes that they'll wrap it up. But I tell you in Bloomington Antique Mall, they are prepared. They have a system. Um, the people who own Exit 76 Antique Mall that I go to a lot also own Bloomington Antique Mall and they got it down. They get your stuff wrapped up and ready. It was seamless. It was painless. They were really quick in checking me out. So I appreciate that. But it's a great antique mall. It's chock full. Full. It's probably the fullest I've ever seen it, which is wonderful. So if you are in the Bloomington in if you're in the Bloomington, Indiana area, come on in to whoops, there we go. The Bloomington Antique Mall. Right here in downtown Bloomington. It's a wonderful shop. A little busy on a Saturday. Maybe go in during the week. You know, it's just, you know, I like to go when it's not as people-y. Uh, but yeah, come in and check it out. Lots of great things to see. Everything that you saw me pick up are things that I had purchased. So if you see something that you might be interested in, you can send me an email, thrifterjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com. I'll let you know if it's available or if it's going to be coming up in an upcoming live sale. I do have live sales every Tuesday and Wednesday at 1 o'clock Eastern on my YouTube channel. I also have one every Wednesday at 10 a.m on whatnot so if you're not following me on whatnot check out the description i have a link that will save you ten dollars when you sign up as a buyer on whatnot so it's a great it's a great great platform and i hope that you'll come over and check it out uh, as well, Sunday night, Sunday night is 4 Eyed Vintage over at the Cult of Vintage YouTube channel. So make sure that you are following him as well so you can check out our 4 Eyed Vintage sales. <gasps> and that's it. That's the video. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the like button on your way out. If you're not subscribed, come on over and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama, some charmer. Yes.